You've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Munkal. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. You are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da, which means push. Da. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master Wolf, I will now gift you the wisdom. speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards, but you are ready. of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. Your training proceeds well, Dragonborn. We spoke the traditional words of greeting to a Dragonborn who has accepted our guidance. The same words were used to greet the young Talos when he came to High Hrothgar before he became the Emperor Tiber Septim. Ah, I sometimes forget you are not versed in the dragon tongue as we are. This is a rough translation. Long has the storm crown languished, with no worthy brow to sit upon. By our breath, we bestow it now to you in the name of Kind, in the name of Shore, and in the name of Atmora of old. You are Ismir now, the Dragon of the North. Hearken to it. Sky, guard you. I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. We drink to our youth, today's come and gone. For the age of aggression is just about done. We'll I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. Blood and our steel, we will take I've been doing this a long time, remember? While the Thalmor have been looking for me, Down I've been watching them. Ulfric, the killer of kings. On the the day Thalmor of ambassador, Elenwen, regularly throws see. parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the embassy, you can get away and find Elenwen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wynn's little party. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Malborn. Any questions?
Sounds good. Be careful. Positions. As far as you need to go home. Go home and stay there until your mother comes. You betrayed oh, us! Tell her that her uncle is scum that betrayed his high king. Best she know now, Ethel. You're all hard. Rogvir, you helped Ulfric Stormcloak escape the city after he murdered High King Torig. By opening that gate for Ulfric, you betrayed the people of Solitude. He doesn't Jacob. deserve to speak! There was no murder. Ulfric challenged Tori. He beat the High King in fair combat. Such is our way. Such is the ancient custom of Skyrim and all Nords. <laughs> On this day, I go to Sovngarde. Who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. The Thalmor takes security very seriously. Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. The rest is up to you. Okay, I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've gotta go. I'll find you at the party. Don't worry. Your job is to get into the party without being... Your job is to get into the party without being fingered as a spy. I'll take care of the rest. Gotta keep my eyes open. That dragon is gonna swoop down at any time. Have you given Malborn the gear you want to smuggle into the embassy? Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Melbourne smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy dressed like... I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. Fellow latecomer to Ellen 
its little soiree. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this God's forsaken mountain than any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. There's not enough. Welcome to the Thalmor Embassy. Your invitation, please. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Now then, here's my invitation. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor Ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, Madam tell me Ambassador, more about yourself. So what brings you to this... <sighs> to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's just that we've run out of the Alto wine. Do I have your permission to uncork the... Of Olympia course. Red? I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you distract the guards, I'll open this door and we can get you on your way. Let's hope we both live through this day. Here you go, sir. The finest Colovian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? Of course. Let me see if we have another bottle of that. I'll be waiting by the door for everyone to be distracted. What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? What does a fellow need to do to get a drink around here? Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles! If there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Wonderful! I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. Is that all? <laughs> My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork. Attention, everyone! Could I have your attention, please? I have an announcement to make. I propose a toast to Ellen Wynn, our Master, mistress. What are you doing? I speak figuratively, of course. Uh, Nothing could be more unlikely than that someone would. Let's go, let's go! Before bed. anyone notices us. Although, most of you are already in bed with her. But again, I speak figuratively, of course. Fine, fine! Get your hands off me! I'll be a good boy now. So far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. We need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking, got it? Follow me. Who comes, Malburn? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Savani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. I need to lock the door behind you. Something's wrong. Did you see those robes marching this morning? 
Who are they with? More of the Emissary's treaty enforcers? No, they're high mages, just in from Alinor. I guess herself is finally getting worried about all the dragon attacks. Ah, good. I've been wondering how we were supposed to defend this place from a dragon. If a dragon does show up, maybe we'll get lucky, and it will eat the mages first. Might give us Do enough time to end. Did you hear something? Expenses, you know. Silence. Do not presume, he said. You are most useful, but do not presume. We have other informants who are less offensive. What was that? No one else has brought you such valuable information, have they? No.
used. I told you. I don't know anything else about it. What? Who... what... what do you want, then? Yeah, sure. Uh, okay. Come on, this way. I've seen the guards use it to get rid of bodies. It must lead somewhere. Let's get out of here. I saw guards dragging bodies over here. Might be a way out. Let's get out of here. I saw guards dragging bodies over here. Might be a way out. They grabbed me in Riften. They seem to think I know something. They just kept asking me the same damn questions. I damn well hope so. If it helps you twist them up, I'm glad to help. They're after some old guy named Esburn. Something to do with dragons. I gathered it from listening to them talk when they thought I was out. I've seen a guy in Riften who they seem to think is him. Not much to go on. I don't even know where he lives or his name, but they seem pretty excited about it. That's it. Now, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Listen up, spy. You're trapped in here, and we have your accomplice. Surrender uh, immediately or you both. <laughs> 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 Now the 
Falmore will be hunting me for the rest of my life. I hope it was worth it. <laughs>